Hello, my friends. This is Sylvie Curry, Lady of Q, and I'm back in my kitchen. Today, I'm going to be showing you what I do with my frozen avocados. Back in August of 2020, which was eight months ago from today's date, we had a lot of avocados fall off the trees. I took a lot of them and I froze them to preserve, to use for a time like now. They were vacuum sealed, and you can see here, They're still looking pretty good. These are thawed out. I took them out this morning. I'm gonna make guacamole. Let's do this. These are my ingredients for making the guacamole. I've got here the equivalent of two avocados. Once again, they were previously frozen. I've got pepper, and I'm only gonna be using maybe about a, maybe a quarter to a half teaspoon of that salt and that's going to be two tastes. I've got some cumin and I'm going to use about a half a teaspoon of cumin. Garlic, probably a tablespoon, of, well maybe less than a tablespoon of garlic I'm going to put in there. I've got red onions and I'm going to add probably the equivalent of a couple of tablespoons of red onions and I got my lemon juice. I'm going to start by opening my packages of bought out avocados and adding them to my container here. And you can see based upon the color, it's pretty well maintained the color of the avocados. I'll mash them a little bit. Then I'm going to add the pepper. And as I said before, it's about a half a teaspoon. I'm going to start out with about a half a teaspoon of salt and add more as we get on to taste. The cumin, I'm adding about a half a teaspoon. Garlic, I'm going to start out with one two teaspoons of garlic, and that's probably equivalent of about two medium-sized cloves. Then I've got the red onion, and I'm going to add, and I usually do this just by eyeball, what it looks like should do well, and I can always add later. And that was probably about a tablespoon of red onion. Lemon juice, I'm going to start off with maybe three teaspoons of lemon juice. Then we're going to mix this all up. And I'm thinking by the way it looks, I can probably add a little bit more red onion. You can also use yellow or white onions, depends on what you have. You see what we have is guacamole from frozen avocados. Now I'm going to taste this. By taste, I know that I need a little bit more salt. And I'm saying that's probably about a, another half a teaspoon of salt. And I'm also going to add a little bit more cumin. Give that a mix. The lemon is coming through, so I don't need to add any more lemon. And the garlic is coming through, so I'm set on that. And there we have creamy guacamole from frozen avocados.